What's going on, world? It's your boy, Kuya P. This is the NR Dub. Nerds, rule the world here to give you another infamous trailer reaction for a product heading to our eyeballs via the movie theater. And it's called Saltburn. You ready to check this one out, Heather? Well, you already did, so sure. <laughs> I did. I did. But I won't taint this uh, react. Let's go to Saltburn. Here we go. Oh, <laughs> nice tux. Thank you. Wow. It's a rental, right? Yeah. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Where, where are we going, Felix? You think you'll go home? Honestly? Home doesn't mean the same for me as it does for you, Felix. Well, why don't you come home with me? Come to Saltburn. why Felix likes you so much. You're so, um, real. Oliver, I have a complete and utter horror of ugliness ever since I was very young. I don't know why. I mean, because you're a terrible person. Lots of people get lost in salt burn. This place, it's not for you. I can honestly say that these last few months have been the happiest of my life. Anything else I should know about? No, no, just be yourself. They'll love you. It, it's relaxed, I promise. Heather, in theaters, uh, select theaters, November 24th, Salt Burn. What do you think of the trailer? What do you think? So of I think we story? actually already did. I think we already did a react to this one before. Because we, this was a, officially announced a couple months ago. Um, but no matter what, it's, I'm very excited for it. Okay. I have seen the trailer. I have already seen the trailer. Um, or maybe it's just that I've seen the trailer already. Yeah, maybe. Um, could be that. Let me see our yeah. channel. No, we never did. We never did. Okay. All right. Yeah. Um, I, I saw so I saw the trailer when it first dropped a couple months ago. Um, okay. It was very intriguing, though, because it, it reminded me a lot of, um, you know, those classic uh, eat the rich horror kind of films. Um, I, I'm not really sure if it's horror. It's it, the trailer kind of gives off the vibe, but I've not I haven't like dug deep into it. Um, but I mean, eat the rich. And it's always fun to see uh, see how people define that in film. Yes. So, especially when it's nothing but rich people making those statements. Yes. So <laughs> I have seen the film. I will have my full review on the channel. I cannot wait for you to see this, Heather, because uh, when I went to see it, I had no clue about it. Didn't see the trailer, didn't know nothing, uh, just blank slate. And coming out of it, uh, I don't know if you saw my initial thoughts that is on our shorts on our YouTube page. I don't know what the fuck I just watched. That that shit was crazy. Um, but uh, just real quick, if you didn't pick it up from the trailer, y'all, uh, Barry Cohen, who we know from Eternals, um, plays this Oxford student, kind of like nebbish cat, who sees uh, Jacob Bellorty, who is in another film that's going to be uh, dropping, uh, will already be out by the week of this release. He's in Priscilla playing Elvis. Um, so I'm sure he's going to rack up some nominations for Elvis uh, and Priscilla as well as this film, because I definitely think this is going to be one of those nominated films come award season. But um, Jacob Elordi, uh is who he meets at Oxford and then goes to stay with him uh, because Jacob Elordi's character is kind of like an aristocrat, Prince William Henry type character. And uh, it kind of goes from there. But Emerald Fennell is the writer director. She did Promising Young Woman. That was a uh, uh, Oscar nominated film. I think it actually like won Best Script or something like a year or two ago. But just amazing. Uh, it's a beautiful film, really well shot. But it is a wild film, and I'm gonna leave it at that. Um, I'm gonna have everything in my full review. But I I'm speechless. And when people see this, and I think when you see this, Heather, this is gonna be talked about a lot. 
Um, I hope it doesn't win out some other films that I think should win all the awards this year. But I definitely think this film will be nominated. Uh, Jacob Elordi is going to get some noms for this, a- along with Priscilla. Uh, Barry Cohen, who is the lead in this, who is, you know, our, well, I forgot what character he is in Internals, Heather. But he was also in Banshees of Inishirin, which is also fantastic, yeah. by the way. And that he was phenomenal in that. But yeah, Barry Cohen is a dope actor. And he he lets it all out in this joint. Let me tell you, everything, everything. You see everything. Everything. He is a savage. I'm going to leave it at that, but he should get a bunch of noms. And also uh, the who you saw at the beginning, uh, the young cat from Gran Turismo is in this as well, and he's great. He's phenomenal in this. And Rosamund Pike, who you saw, uh, she has an amazing scene. But again, I'll break it all down in my review, but this film, a lot of people are going to be talking about. And so uh, I definitely wanted to do a react to this outside of my review because there's going to be some conversations about this Joker. Um, but again, beautifully shot, right. well acted. So stay tuned for that review. But Heather, yes, crazy. I wish you could. Have, this is one of the films, you know, we see a lot of films together uh, and we, you know, we do reviews that I really wish you would have been at because I didn't know what the fuck I was sending into. And I still don't know what the fuck I just watched with that film. And I can't wait to talk, talk to you all the things about that damn film. So anyway, uh, salt burn, y'all. Heather. Uh, if you want to talk to Heather and myself and more, uh, hit us up in the comments. But whoo, this film, y'all, Saltburn, your boy KP, Heather, Nerds Rule the World. Let us know what you think in the comments below.